big boost up to the top. Boy! I did not think he was going to make that jump. I'm not going to lie. Oh, here we go. Oh, he jumped off of his equipment mid-ravine. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let me, let me paint a picture for you all today. You go home from school. You go, you, your, your high school, your middle school, whatever age you were. You get home, you set down your backpack by the front door, you take off your shoes, you go over to the refrigerator, you grab yourself a snack, maybe something out of the pantry, maybe some gushers, fruit snacks, whatever it may be. You head upstairs, you sit down, you turn on the TV, you turn on your Xbox, and on pops to the screen, Halo 3. You sit down, you put on your really crappy headset that comes with the console, and you play all night with your friends. This was the golden age of gaming. You not only had Halo 3 at this time, but you actually also had Call of Duty 4. It was literally the golden age of gaming, and I miss it so, so much. And today, we are we are going back, we are living through that again. For the people who are my age, the people who are older, everybody who lived in this golden age of gaming, we are gonna see the thing that we sat down and we never could do. Beat Halo 3 on Legendary, and not only on Legendary, but in a speed run of one hour and 13 minutes, the entirety of Halo 3, one of the greatest games of all time, ran by Mr. Rokats. I will have him down below in the description. Somehow this video has 367,000 views and is unlisted. So I'll have this man down below in the description. If y'all would rather watch the original, go, go ahead and head over there. But without further ado, this is gonna be truly, truly a special occasion. Ladies and gentlemen, Oh my god, hold on. I gotta I gotta pump the music. I, oh my god. Oh my god. I have to literally pump the music. First squad, you're my scouts. Move out as quiet as you can. Bro. The the amount of memories. <laughs> the, <laughs> Bravo team, this is Johnson. We got him. Oh my god. <laughs> What is it with Halo speedrunners and killing their their friendlies? Dude, the amount of times that I loaded up this mission on Legendary and just as as a terrible video gamer could not beat it is insane. It's truly insane. And this man is about to speedrun the absolute crap out of this game. I can't wait to see the tricks, man. If you guys have missed the other Halo speedruns, I wow, okay. I strongly, strongly recommend you go watch the other two first because I think a lot of the stuff that happened in that one, oh my god, the halo mechanics and the halo jumping is so sick, man. Using the physics to get those speed boosts by landing on like a certain area is so sick. Look, dude, he's like basically sprinting. People said, hey, halo is better when it didn't have sprint. You're wrong. This game had sprint if you landed correctly. Look at that. The physics in Halo 3 were just unmatched. They were actually unmatched. They're so special, man. And that's, I, that's why I can't wait for the movement. Can't wait for seeing what happens in this game, man. I I, I truly can't. I want to see if the, if the sword melee is shooting. I, I don't know what the right... I don't know what the sword lunging across the map. I want to I wonder know if that's a thing. I'm really, really excited, man. I'm really, really excited. Obviously, this is just an early intro into it. And maybe not many tricks just yet. It's a double kill with a grenade. Mm, easy. Easy clap. If he, if he lands that grenade. I was about to say, that grenade did not look like it was going to land. I guess it doesn't really need to land. He got a checkpoint there. He is running past the enemies. Bro, I'm not going to lie. So far... Ooh, okay, never mind. Never mind. And you don't have that that additional health bar in this game to truly tell you how low you actually are. Like, of your actual health. I think he messed up a little bit there. He, he looked like he was... Uh, that, that actually was a little bit slower than just running normally. So, I'm sure... I'm sure he's... Obviously, he's fine with it. But... Dude, just using this terrain for jumps is so sick. He's gonna hit some quick assassinations here. Oh my god. <laughs> Bro, this man does not get a hold of her. Negative. We're going down. Whoa! 
<laughs> Bro, this is incredible. I, I know it's like really not that crazy, but just, it, it's like you can't truly appreciate these kinds of runs unless you've played the game before, which makes me like want to go and play every single game that I've ever reacted to a speedrun on uh, just to see how like how incredibly just like impressive some of this stuff really is like you can i can appreciate it for the games like dark souls and the blood boards and stuff like that but like uh, dude it's like games like batman which i reacted to recently i need to go and play those games so i can understand how truly incredible those experiences actually are whenever like like how how truly impressive it is find johnson before he's captured dude just already the intro to this game is so much better than the the first two like the first two campaigns are really really good and really fun but the intro to this just throws you right into it it's, it's so good all right quid pro quo quo quick jump off that oh he's already dude uh, the number of times he's been one shot already is so much more than the previous games too So much more. Yeah, Halo 3 Legendary is a different beast, man. It really, really is. Dude, I, I, it, it's the craziest part is like how much work went into like finding out the best strats and everything like that. It's like the same with every game. You have like almost like two different sets. You have like the finders and then you have like the 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 incredible runners you know what i mean oh my god that gravity hammer oh monka hey is he gonna go for the hammer he does okay this is where we're gonna truly learn this is where we're gonna truly learn if if any sort of like sword skating or anything like that is in this game the aim required too man the aim on top of everything else the aim required to play these halo games is incredible okay good stuff you got a couple kills there Beautiful. What is, dude, is, is, is he? I feel like he's having to respect the, the fact that this game is on legendary so much more than in the previous ones. So much more. Like he, 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 he actually reminds me of how he's on Focus. legendary right here. Oh, what is this? <gasps> oh, <laughs> Bro, what? Oh my God. <laughs> well, now I understand what he was doing. He was literally just waiting to do that trick to get on the, the ship Sorry mega early the and trigger the cutscene. Dude, know your role. Come on, sir. I'll show you the way. <laughs> he's like, tr he's like, listen, trust me. I think I know the way. Watch your feet. Little crouch jump. Secure perimeter defenses. Point of entry. Best assessment. Hanger, Sergeant. I, I really thought that at least one of those friendlies was going to die right there. I truly thought Chief, that at least one of them was going to die. This channel is secure. My fire teams are spread thin. We can't hold out forever. I need that hangar cleared for evac ASAP. He says, he says, clear the hangar. Let me throw one grenade real quick and then and, and I'll, uh, I'll hook you up here. Oh my God. The metals, dude. <laughs> All of them are just panicking there. Oh, that was a one burst double headshot. I also wonder how much of this is RNG in terms of like enemy spawns, enemy movements, like how much RNG is actually needed. Because in the previous ones, it wasn't like an insane amount. It was always like one or two second saves if you got like good RNG, if that makes sense. Like good RNG was definitely needed to get the world record, but it wasn't like your run was over if you missed one or two good RNGs. 
Uh, that's new. That's new verb I'm uh, making up right here. RNGs. Two RNGs. I don't think I ever knew that you could continue charging the plasma pistol while you threw a grenade. I don't think I ever knew that. The flashbangs, man. All right, easy cleanup. Oh yeah, he got some equipment here. Woo! Dude, he's just showing off. There was literally no reason to do that. There was actually no reason to do that right there. He just wanted to style on him. All dead. Bro, the plasma pistol, literally the MVP of this game. I'm not even kidding. Oh, he missed. He missed. Oh, I, I, I mean, I'm sure it's fine. All right, so it's weapon, weapon juggling the brew shot. And, uh, okay, I was about to say, that's a kind of a weird weapon to, to, to keep because it's kind of useless, but. <laughs> so he needs this brew shot probably for a jump in a second. I would guess that this brute shot is for a, for a jump that he's going to do here soon. Dude, it's, it's so satisfying when you, when when, you, when people know the spawns and everything. And the fastest way to just take out all the enemies. All right, here we go. Here's where we're going to see the brute shot really go in. Dude, this game really is a lot of aim. Because if he didn't kill anything there, that was a ton of lost time if it got behind cover or something. And, and you need to like manage your grenades and everything like that so you can do grenade jumps. Here's the big guns. <laughs> there we go. Here's the second. He has two plasma grenades. So he's going to do one just normal grenade boost to get some extra speed there. Because why not? Dude, it's a good thing on legendary grenades don't kill you. Like, you don't have just straight up lower health. Otherwise, you wouldn't be able to do grenade jumps and stuff like that, which would suck. And, and another thing that you like you have to keep in mind during this is that he is playing on legendary. Oh my god, that. Huh? Bro, look at his medals going. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I'd be glad he was on our side too. This man can literally see the future. So he wasn't using a brute shot jump, he was just spawn killing some more of those. Gift with purchase. Dude, the Halo mission names were, were goaty, man. They really were. They were so good. A little, a little jump boost there. I, 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 all of these obviously have, like, names in the Halo community. I'm going to call those, like, Let's Boost or something. Okay. He picks up Grav Hammer. Oh, my God. Does he... Wait, did he just pick up a, a, an Overshield? Is that why he's invincible? Or... Cortana Munka. Oh, here we go. Are we going to see some crazy Halo physics here? Oh my God. Yes, we are. I, I don't know if he was supposed to hit that wall there. I think he was probably supposed to boost the entire way. Oh my God. Yes. Yeah. And then he hit the wall so he didn't actually die. He needed to kill his momentum there. He's going to skip the... Uh, skip the waiting for the elevator doors to open there. He's just going to jump around. Did you see it? Oh. oh, I thought he was going to do another boost like they did in Halo 2 where it just shot you up. I really thought that was going to happen. Um, Bro, this is so good so far. Oh, it's going to boost him through the wall. Oh, never mind. He's just going to use it to jump out. The elevators boost you through the wall in this game. Shake them off, Lieutenant. And he is riding a ship. He is landing right on the spawn points. Dude! This is so sick, man! <laughs> he gets the assassinate, too. I think he got... Or did he just melee? Hard to tell. Oh, 
Bro, all of this on legendary too. Oh, this guy's not, this guy is not cooperating. Got him. I guess it doesn't matter anyway, cause he was going this way anyway. Eh, probably like a two or three second time loss there. Ooh. 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 He's one oh, shot. I wonder, dude, if he manages to do the, I mean, that's an accomplishment in and of itself, right? Doing the entire campaign flawless. That's like an insane accomplishment. And to do it all that fast too, not just like camping it out or anything. You will be the protectors of Earth and all her colonies. Thank you, Cortana. In the Very cool. <laughs> Dude, the, the, the thing you have to think about as well is when you get flung like that, if you hit a wall at the right, like if you just hit a flat wall, you die. He's got a hammer. <laughs> if you hit a flat wall, you literally die. So he's having to not only do that, but also manage his landing here. We have taken their command center. Have you discovered how they plan to stop me? Uh, as yet, no more coffee. Find us like So he's just gonna go ahead and activate that and jump in. Bro, I effing love this so far. Halo 2, I think I really enjoyed for the, the, Halo, the sword jumps. It's all about the grab hammer in this one though. It truly is all about the grab hammer in this one. Jumping past all the enemies and stuff as well. There will be a great deal of hardship on the road ahead. So we got big Cortana there. He's just using a little grenade boost and a hammer hit to give him some distance while Cortana's talking. He obviously doesn't need the ammo or anything. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, what? He's doing me, dude. He's literally doing the exact same thing as the sword, the sword hits from Halo 2. This because he's doing a lunge, but then he's switching his weapon he, so he doesn't actually kill the thing he's lunging at. You will become the best we can make you. Dude, he's he's canceling the lunge so he's sticking on them instead of instead of killing it. Oh my God, let's go. Oh my God, this is so, dude. Gra I, I, hey, friendship ended with energy sword. I'm only friends with the grab hammer now. And that's this mission. Place will become your home. <laughs> okay, Cortana. You're really slowing down the speed run here. Dude. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was so sick. Nine minutes and what? Like ten seconds for that entire mission? Right? This place will become your tomb. Okay, thank you, Cortana. You're, again, you're not helping. And 923, I'm gonna guess, is when the mission ends. Uh, 922, it was close. So, it's melee, switch weapons, switch weapons back, melee. Melee, switch weapons, switch weapons back, melee. And that's how you skate across the top. That's insane. That is truly unbelievable. That's truly unbelievable. Boots on the line. If you can hear me, find transport. Head to Chief's the got the right idea. Let's Chief's got the up. right idea. Out of these caves. Where Let's go. Let Lead Marines away from base. He's actually, hey, he's actually waiting for his teammates here. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, well then. <laughs> he cared about exactly two teammates. Probably because he needs them to do some sort of weird boost off of him or something. Dude, I, I, I think that that's one of the, I think those are the best designs of video games. That the mission design is like more open so that speed runs exist type thing, you know what I mean? Like obviously you don't want your game to be intentionally glitchy, but like having some sort of design where you can do it like boost with a grab hammer off the wall and land in a ship to trigger the cutscene earlier. That's what makes these old games so good for speedrunning. And the new games are so like linear and like you have to hit this checkpoint and then this checkpoint and there's not as many glitches in them because they are made better. And it's like a blessing and a curse, right? Because in a casual playthrough, you obviously want your game to be as bug free and like great as possible. In this type of game, it's, it's fine though. Bro, I, I, I would have blown up seven times by now if I was playing this on Legendary. I'd be reloading that checkpoint real quick. Boys, 
he picking up he's picking up a new warthog those there's those patented halo physics right there wait what did he just do he picked up a, wait did he just i think he picked up a grab lift he like went in there and picked up a grab lift so i'm excited to see how he manages to use this Woo! look at that back right wheel that thing is squeaking man that thing is actually squeaking right now <laughs> Oh, I can't wait for the ending of this game on Legendary Speedrun, dude. Have y'all ever seen those videos of, like, the biggest ships in Halo? Oh, this is why he, this is why he went back to grab that grab lift. Woo! Oh, that's so dope. You're not supposed to have the Warthog here, but he's keeping that momentum. Oh, yeah, that, that time save is definitely paying for itself right there. 100% paying for itself to, to go and get that gravel lift. That's what I'm talking about, man. It's what makes this game so good. It truly feels like... I know the next Halo is, like, gonna actually be open world or whatever, but this is... It's like... The mission is yours to figure out how you want to do it and not just like, a, oh, there's a stealth route and then there's a shoot route. It's like, no. Here you go. Figure out how you want to do it. Oh, the fuel rod. Let's go, baby. He's going to the side. He said, they want me to jump off this bridge. I'm a speedrunner. I don't listen to anything you say. Man, this, this really was the golden age of Halo, huh? This really was it. I really hope the next Halo is good, man. I really hope. Oh. I thought he was trying to kill that, but I think he was just trying to... Oh, he's breaking the barrier here. And that triggers the cutscene. What? So he knows exactly what he has to trigger in order to trigger that. You have to destroy, I guess you have to destroy that like turret type thing, which he did. And then you have to destroy the barrier and you get to skip all the enemies. It truly is like a mastery of the game. He still has the fuel rod, by the way. Ghost town, let's go. Chief, the Prophet of Truth has found the Ark. Our only chance of stopping him is a surprise aerial assault. Clear this sector of Covenant anti-air defenses. Make a hole for the Admiral's ship. And just the music Good going the entire time, man. Oh. Oh. It's incredible. It truly is incredible. The music makes the halo. Oh, shit. He just killed the driver. He said, LOL, let me through. A lot of dude this is i i i mean the halo 2 speed run was fun for other reasons but this is truly a fantastic speed run so far there is like tricks skill aim like glitches all of that it's like get the f out of the warthog i already killed one enemy Yee, red screen All right, he's through. Because Forward under Don. Commander. Atmospheric disturbance is intensifying above the artifact. Yeah, that, that would be that would be a fun video to react to, like the the Move size the comparison from like all the ships. I, I I would I would love to see that. It's such an interesting video. Yeah. Woo! Kill atrocity. Kill apocalypse. Kill him, Jaro. Destroy all other race. Did he, did he destroy him already? Uh, we got the rocket launcher. Dude, there's just so much more varied mission design, if that makes sense. He says, oh, well, I don't wait for the door to open. I have defied gods and demons. Thank you, Cortana. Very cool. Show me one person who asked. <laughs> oh, God. That I'm sure there's some sort of glitch where the AI blows you up. I am sure there's some sort of glitch. Oh, you gotta, yeah, you gotta honk the mongoose when you're driving the mongoose, dude. You gonna 
take this missile turret? Bro, that guy did not want to die. Woo, that perfectly timed ro a rocket shot as well. And another missile turret. One down, one to go. And zero down, zero to go. What a shot. Was that bad? I feel like that was bad. I feel like half those missiles just missed. Maybe not. Does he have to wait for it to come back around? He's practicing his, his melee things. The one solo monk. No, did he do it? No, I think he's good. I think he's good. He's good. And this guy is still on the mongoose. <laughs> <Okay, laughs> sir, he's one of ours. More like, sir, Stand by. please kill Somebody me for your speed run. Your I guess you have to melee the mongoose in there because there's some sort of weird, like. Trying, he's trying to use the mongoose to clip through the wall. It's getting closer. Oh, this can't be good, man. Scare him. Oh, <laughs> that is so dope, man. Well done, Chief. I'm sending in a few pelicans. That is so cool, dude. One more target, Chief. So J -j just the way the it's year. like a slow build up, too. Dude, I swear, like, even modern day games don't have this kind of, like, freedom in missions. Like, uh, like of course there's a there's a route that you can go out, outside of the window right there. Like, of course there is. That's, uh, like, why wouldn't there be? It makes sense. It's like a real active, like, environment type thing. Did he just use that shield so they didn't shoot him in the back? Because that's what it seems like. Through the window again. Clears the window. Big sniper energy. Oh, did he? Wait, he didn't pick up the grab hammer? No, I'm so sad. I'm so sad he didn't pick up the grab hammer. No, you have no idea how upset that makes me. That's one way to uh, one way to finish it early. <laughs> that's crazy. That's that's literally insane. That actually is the fact that you could do that that early on. <sighs> oh. It followed me home. Munka. The flood. It's spreading all Monka. over the city. The flood, Munka. Find the crashed flood ship. Overload its engine core. We either destroy this city squad, or risk board. losing the entire planet. Multiple contacts. Unknown hostile. <laughs> Chief, make there. your way to the crash site. Isn't that like? Isn't Sorry, that like? Sergeant. Oh, did he? Yes, he got it. Find the crashed flood ship. He's, he's moving this this barrel into position so we can launch off of it. Oh, I love it so much. I truly love it so much. The flood's like, wait, 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 wait. We're not ready yet. Dude. It's like actually a friendship ended with with uh, energy sword type type thing. Small little boost there. Little grenade boost. All while making sure you don't die. Out through the window, back into the main mission. <laughs> Good 
goes above the room of death. Dude, this movement is cracked. You know he's happy about that. That was literally perfect right there. Dude, I was thinking at the beginning, I was like, I, I know these later missions. <laughs> what in the world? These glitches are actually mad. Using the deployable cover to launch you across an entire ravine, skipping half the mission. Why not, right? All on legendary too. Keep that in mind. All of this is on legendary. All these enemies are hitting like trucks right now. And the, the crazy thing, he actually hasn't even been out of bounds like once. Like actually one single time he has not been out of bounds. Oh, here we go. Oh, he jumped off of his equipment mid ravine. <laughs> he jumped off of his equipment mid ravine. Dude. I love it. I love it so much. Oh, there was an energy sword right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure thing, bud. Sure thing, bud. If you say so. He only has one hammer swing left. Unless there's some sort of crazy glitch with that, too. He passed up the energy sword, so it really is friendship ended. A little parkour to get up above. One last hit. Wow. Wow, he's being stun locked into this cutscene type thing. He gets there early, and that's mission over. <laughs> he used the boost while he was getting slowed down, because you get slowed down whenever someone talks to you in your head type thing, to like a crawling pace. Just like Cortana. So he used that momentum to get him to the cutscene before he was even finished talking. Skip the entire thing. I also love how... Uh, what's it called? I love how it's all in English too. He's like, yeah, you know, some people play in other languages to make it faster. Nah. In Halo, we just play straight English, brother. All right, what, what are we going to do here? It's gonna be an, this is going to be an interesting mission. I can tell. I can already tell by the amount of open areas that we're going to see some crazy stuff. Woo, that collapsed. That was dope. That was dope. Another clat. Big boost up to the top. And around the side. All of these guys literally don't even haven't even spawned in yet. Got some brute shot ammo. Five more bullets. Almost a full magazine. Opened up. How have you guys been just been chilling over here the whole time? Did y'all not see all the enemies over there? Oh, big rocket launcher. Big, and here's the mongoose. So he's playing uh, rocket snipes right now. He's playing rocket snipes. Great playlist, must say. Ooh, that's interesting. Dude, that was like an actual stealth part in a Halo game. That was the stealth part. He he was, uh, he, he like avoided their aggro right there. Switches to the ghost. The ghost is probably faster, I would say. Yeah, with the boost, yeah. Not as maneuverable, but definitely faster. Probably can't clip through any doors if you get out of it either. Oh... We saw this in Halo 2. Using the ghost to scale walls. Yee! Nice. Good stuff. I, I'm, dude, I'm literally thinking. What?
What? <laughs> Ooh, he almost got stuck there. Bro, it, it, I mean, you already kind of feel like a super soldier whenever you play this game. You already feel like a super soldier. He truly looks like a super soldier right now. Plant a grenade in that one. And a plant a grenade in this one. Oh my God. <laughs> oh. I, 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 I forget he's on legendary. I was like, why is he taking cover against that guy? Oh yeah, because people effing one shot you in this. Wow. <laughs> Imagine being like outfitted with like three ghosts, four tanks, bunch of turrets, bunch of wires, dude. Uh, a platform to, to camp on, some ships, and you would just get annihilated in about 30 seconds by Master Chief right there. Oh, what is this? Oh, what is this? Woo! I think, I th does that ship like give you a blowback? Forward to Undone. Come to the back of the frigate. Johnson, have the elites found anything? Structure on the other side of the wall, man. But he was getting the ghost to an area where it could actually drive. I've got a plan. And now that it can drive, you can take it all the way. Dude, that looks so sketchy because it looked like the ghost is literally about to explode. So if you do that wrong, like, at all, it's over. Spark will be happy to pry them open. Lead friendly armor through the wall. <laughs> And by through the wall, we mean through these wall clips. Yeah, I really thought he was going to blow up. I was like, maybe he's just going for a checkpoint, but. All armor, form up on the lower doorway. Chief, get upstairs. Have your robot pick that lock. And boost. Oh. <laughs> Look at explosions. Dude, this this mission is just so BA, man. It really, really is. Oh, did he actually hit that shot? Oh, this guy is not cooperating. Two more shots should do it. Never mind. One more shot will do it. That's unfortunate. That guy did not die on the first shot. Dude, there is actually a lot of killing. I, there's not much like... I mean, there's... I mean, obviously, he just went out of bounds kind of there. But there's... You actually have to play the mission. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? Like, you do it very quickly and you skip some parts. But you're, he's actually play, playing the mission. All right. The grenade and <laughs> melee the body because he just has to wait right now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was the most, like. <laughs> he said, yeah, yeah, I think that fits in there. Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna go through a wall again. I think. Oh, never mind. He's just he's just positioning his car. This car. Chat. Imagine if imagine if everybody drove cars like this. There's something so funny about just having this giant vehicle in areas Good where you're not supposed to have a giant vehicle. Up with our armor on the far side of the wall. Make your way down to the cartographer. The drums, man. The drums, man. One of the best to ever do it. He's like, what do you want me to do? Run across all this open area? Nah, I'm good. Nah, I'm good. Do, 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 do. 
Wait, why are, they, why are those guys dead already? Did he kill those guys earlier? I can't remember. Oh boy, this is gonna be, this is gonna be interesting right here. Doing a lineup. Bro! Oh my god! <laughs> See, I love that! I literally love that! If you can manage to get yourself onto the vehicle early, you can beat the mission. And look at that, it just explodes. Cool guys, don't look at Explosions 2.0 right there. Dude, I, that's, that's what I think video games should be. If you can manage to do it in a faster way than intended, the, the like everything should be triggerable, you know what I mean? You should be able to progress. A little ramp off there. Gotta right yourself. Infantry on the spire. Ooh, don't fall off. Pop them up. Don't fall off. I, I, dude, at this mission, I don't remember at all. I have no idea what the next objective is. No idea. How'd that guy not die? Man, blasted him with like three brute shots. Got the sniper rifle. <laughs> Bro, just the like slightly disappointed noise every time. He's one of ours. Like, he's like not even just mad that you you literally just shot a teammate. He's one of ours. <laughs> Real men don't read maps. Okay. <laughs> okay, Halo. <hey, well. laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I every time I go anywhere, I'd be pulling up that Google Maps, you know what I'm saying? Is that guy peeing? What in the world? Kill them as they sleep. Chief, tap them out. Kill them as they sleep. Dude, Chief, Chief, not very honorable, dude. You're not very, that's not very Jin Sakai of you, you know what I'm saying? Oh, they literally were all asleep, though. <laughs> you hear the grunt. Fall oh, back! Woo! Good stick. How many shots? He's got 12 shots. Ah, no! The first death. Sad. Bro, that, that just shows you how lucky he's been the whole time. When you can die that fast. Sad. Sad. I'm sure that hurts in more ways than one, too, because you like... I'm sure it, sometimes it's not a guarantee if you get... Uh, if you get if you get to keep the uh what's it called grenades and everything like that so that you can speed run that area and he just jumps right in there chief, you got a whole mess of hostile air inbound how many voice lines in this game start with chief follow the oracle spark chief i will help your sergeant clear the sky oh did he just get stuck how is he alive how did he die in the Bro, this part is difficult. I will clear the sky. This part is effing difficult, bro. Dude, that last guy is just owning him. This part is so hard. It looks like you keep your same ammo. It just, like saves your entire game state. Dude. That, that little shotgun pistol? I forgot, I forgot what it's called. I can't remember right now for some reason. Is owning him. Yeah, you see the RNG? The, the guy ran to the other side that time? Finally, dude. Oh my goodness. Woo! The fact that this is like... The fact that this is world record shows you how hard that is too. And he's through. Not doing great on ammo wise. He has one bullet uh, spare. Oh. Hang tight, Chief. We're on our way. Did he get all of them? Don't die! Don't die! Don't die! Don't die! Woo! Bro. 
That was that was high risk, high reward right there for sure. Definitely high risk, high reward for sure. So what, what time? That was probably like what 40 seconds of time lost or so from all of his deaths there. Maybe a minute, could be counting the first one as well. If that still shows you just oh he has one brute shot shot. Never mind, he's just gonna wait. I thought he was gonna boost onto the ship. I really thought he was going for it, man. I thought this man was absolutely full sending it. I guess you have to do it zero skulls as well, like no skulls. That'd be interesting, like like allowing to use any skulls. I wonder if that would make it any faster. Oh, one of the, one of the most iconic Over. weapons of Roger all time, man. Get out of there. The Spartan laser. Dude, the grenade tosses are clean as well. I truly think that this is this weapon right here is one of the best designed. Well, he just threw it to the ground. Very cool. It, I, I think it truly is one of the. Uh, huh? <laughs> the instant hijack on that. I think it's one of the most iconic, like best designed weapons ever, man. Because it's so like balanced at the same time as being like iconic but very powerful. I think I think it's just it's just a pinnacle, man. It really is a pinnacle for me. That instant hijack was really interesting too. I, I also love how random things in this game have physics, like that those trees kind of like bent over when you're running them over. <laughs> yeah, you see, <laughs> it like it just it just makes a little noise and bends over. It, it, it's completely fine. It's a very bendable tree. Hostile anti-air has been neutralized. So I think this part right here, I wonder if he's actually going to use this at all or he's just using it to like progress because to, to, it's faster than running. You see how that random tree branch, that like little trunk just randomly had physics? So it's so weird. He's probably going to go for this ghost. Yeah, I was about to say. Oh, I thought that the ghost was going to explode. He continues to defy expectations. So all of that was probably just faster than any sort of grenade boost or running or anything like that that he can do. He's living. I think I think the decision to react to the legendary runs of all these games was definitely in the play. Because, I mean, the, the easy modes are like five minutes faster. Because obviously you don't actually have to worry about dying. You can just... Speed run everything. Oh, he, he's like on an invisible barrier here. But I think the legendary is that much more impressive, dude. It really, really is. Woo, he almost died. Did he, did he not want that uh, bubble shield? That guy dropped a bubble shield. Oh, yes. The hammer. The hammer, dude. Good work, Chief. That's one. The Arbiter I'm hoping. Just I'm hoping. That's two. I want to see at Draw least one sword lunge now. in this entire game. Get back outside, Chief. Wait for transport. Activate that. Johnson, was he uh, supposed to land on the little visible barrier? I guess not, because he's going down. He wants to be lower, not higher. I'm on my way. Quick little overshield here. Or invincible. I forgot. I, I, I forget what causes him to get this. Oh, it was it, is it a little power up. It's like a little invulnerability power up. I forget. Make your way back to the beach. Get in, sir. Get into this to this uh, warthog with no uh, no turret on it. He said, "Come on, let me try." <laughs> My man's on the mongoose, whipping the mongoose around. Come on, let me try. Three physics randomly yes yes very good the ending is gonna be so pog bro we're we're moving too through this i think my favorite mission so far was the mission where he was in the vehicles that one was really good or nah, actually the grab hammer mission the mission where he where he did all those launches that's my favorite vehicle mission where he where he did the like jump up onto the little like Spider tank was it a scarab? I can't remember. But it's been a while since I played this game. Huh? He just knocks over the war dog. 
Here we go. If you want it done right, you know what they say. Bro, th th this game just took everything that Halo was and expanded on it so well. Expanded on it so well. He's staying low so he doesn't get shot at, too. He's l quite literally flying under the radar right here. Quite literally flying under the radar. This is going to be really embarrassing, but I don't know if he's using keyboard or uh, keyboard and mouse or uh, controller. I think he's using keyboard and mouse, but I actually can't remember... I thought it, I guess, but then again, I thought it said RB for some stuff, but I don't know. I was fully expecting some, uh, some glitches there. I, 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 I'm going to be honest. I thought he was 100% going through the wall or something. Okay, he wants that brood shot. No, okay, yeah, I, I, it says, it says up there, hold D to switch. Woo, that's a lot of bugs. Oh, those guys. Monka. You guys know all about those. Okay, so this is the same, like, model of elevator, so we can stand on this invisible spot up here. Dude, it's it's just... This is the greatest in terms... Woo! Bro, that was clean. Because the enemy's AI doesn't activate till the lift gets at the top, so we got like a bunch of free shots. Oh, no! Okay, okay, thank goodness he got a checkpoint right here. Bro, why did he die from that the first time? Actually, that thing blows up and he dies. The flood. No, not the flood. Anything but the flood. Yeah, so I, what I was going to say is the way that barrier actually works is, um, like, the reason you can stand on that invisible barrier is it wants you to think that this, like, beam of light you can't go into because it's so powerful and it would, like, hurt you, whatever. But it's really just an invisible tube that only goes up so high. So if you boost on top of that, you can stand on top of it. It's really, really an interesting, like, clever way they code the game. I thought he was going to try to run through that door and he was going to run the sticky grenade right to him. I love how the, like, the big exploding ones are just, you can just ignore, basically. Is that, like, a quick grenade throw? Quickly, I must see the point of assessment. Little damage jump off the there. Shipmaster's carrier is out of commission, Chief. I need you Breach to the Citadel. The flood's just going to put pressure on him, accelerate his plans. Punch the in. Get inside Bro, the we're so close! We're so close! I mean, what, what, what is the entire run? One minute, thir what, one minute? Yeah, the entirety of Halo beat in one minute, 13 seconds. Dude, if you guys have any ideas, so normally I like to re react speedruns that are like at least 20 minutes long type thing. But if you guys have any speedruns that are like 10 minutes or less, I'm, I, I'm starting up a new series uh, where I'm asking, uh, obviously getting permission, everything like that. But I'm going to react to uh, like super, super short games. I'm talking like one, two minute speedruns, AKA like the Minecraft tool assisted speedrun. All the world records that are like unbelievably like you can beat the entire game in a minute and it's gonna be a little compilation of like five of them type thing um so if you guys have any games that are like beatable and under you know what i mean under like one minute or whatever that's that's what you gotta watch out for. also chief just chucked yeah they are scarabs lands on the scarab early Is this Pelican okay? Yeah, Pelican's just chilling, dude. Oh, cool, guys. Don't look at explosions. Lands on the top of this one. He also kind of chucked his Pelican. First I guess he's skipping down. all the enemies. All units, concentrate your fire on number two. He was trying to shoot the driver out of there. Woo! Big kaboom. World record pace. Imagine, you're like, you're like, 
Elite troop carry. Wow, nice shot by the AI right there. Oh wait, was that the scarab exploding? Never mind. Not nice shot. Go Arbiter. Run. Wait, was that not the Arbiter? Oh, it was. Dude, if only we had more time. Yeah, the speedrunner would like to tell you a little something, something about time right here. Did that, did that warthog despawn? Dude, oh, this song, bro. Literally the best, man. Great boost. Oh my God, and the bunny hops as well. Activates that invis. That was so clean. Why is the ship so long? Go, go, go. I can barely keep hold of it, Chief. And a little tiny baby boost off there. Head back to the lift. Find a way down. But he just made it all the way down here in like one second. Escape the flood. Everybody always tries to escape the flood, but no one, you know, just checks in on them. See, maybe they're just not misunderstood. Maybe they just need to... Maybe they, maybe they just need some love, you know what I'm saying? Oh, new grab hammer that he killed earlier. Oh, and then these little weapon crates are big boosters right here. Woo! Oh my god! Okay, yeah. That was a good spot to trigger that invincibility right there. I'm a thief, but I keep what I steal. Oh, Cortana, you're scaring me. Cortana, you're scaring me. The music as well. Dun, 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 dun. Big kaboom, big kaboom. Oh, look, look who was super useful that entire time. Look who's just standing at the start of the hallway. Good stuff, dude, good stuff. Wow, that entire mission done. Cortana, here we go. Cleanse high clarity, save Cortana. Here we go. Rampant. Ew. Grody. Grody. A nasty. Bro, they really did make the flood gross in this game. This is the first game where you could like really see just how gross Sorry they were. My enemy. Why have you come? I offer no forgiveness. The father's sins pass to his son. Very cool. <laughs> Very spook. Very spook. <laughs> Alright, you got a new grab hammer. Bro, bro the, the flood seem like they, I mean, they are like, you know, the flood. But they literally do, I, li I love how he jumped over that thing and used it as a grenade boost right there. Central right here. Wait, what was that? Why did he throw that? I thought he was going to use it for another super boost. Wait, 
Wait, do a sword boost. You're not sword boosting. Uh, it's probably not a thing in this game. And I am so sad about it. He's, I mean, he's kind of using it for a little mini boost. He got rid of the sword. Bro, it, it straight up is friendship ended with, with the sword. I've never been more sad in my entire life. How many, I wonder what the percentage of enemies killed to enemies Time actually. Has taught me patience. Basking in new freedom. I will know all that I possess. Ooh. 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 Very scary. Very, very scary. Ooh, that was a risky boy jump right there. Oh, and then he blocked his exit with that so he didn't die. That's kind of crazy. It, like, like when you think about it, I'm... I have walked the edge of the abyss. I have seen the future and I have learned. Submit! End her torment and my own! No, I don't think I will. No. Mm -mm. I don't think I will. Oh, big boy boots! Oh, he's moving! We'll show me what she hides, or I shall feast upon your mouth. <laughs> There's two of us in here now, remember. Oh, dude, it, it, the game starts off so like, you know what I mean? Like it just changes so much. Now, at last I see her secret is revealed. Why did he break that? Why is he breaking all the useful stuff? Oh yeah, I, I forgot there was still a ton of enemies in here that he just didn't kill. This reactor, start a chain reaction. Destroy high charity. Oh yeah, ugly. All right, there's three. Three shots down. Ooh, he has like an, oh, I think he has the overshield or an invincibility or an invisibility or something. You heard it, Chief, but not for long. We need to get to Halo. Destroy the flood once and for all. Yeah, 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 yeah. Once and for all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure they won't come back. I'm I'm absolutely sure of it. Run, run, run. This this I feel like this mission is is all about like your movement. Like if you look at him, he he's shooting a few things, but it really is all about like it's very little, like, precise shooting, if that makes sense. Like, how, kind of how the other ones were. Wait. <gasps> he laid that down earlier for an escape route. My mind is blown, dude. My mind is blown. My mind is actually blown. <laughs> I was like, why did he waste that? And that's why it wasn't a waste at all. Oh, don't die. Don't die. He almost, dude, aside from that, like, literally one part, and that, I, I mean, he did die uh, one other time, but, I mean, aside from those two parts, it's been a deathless run. It's been a flawless legendary run. Just running it, gunning it straight through the entire thing. It's so impressive, man. All right, he's out of ammo in the brute shot. 
Wait, you two made nice? What else did you do? And he's out of there. Woo! All right, light the ring, destroy the flood. Par time, 20 minutes. Par score, 24,000. Yeah, let's see, if the, let's see if this mission takes him 24 minutes. We'll see. Although, in, unless it actually does. Wait a second. Oh, no, it's definitely not. It's definitely not. <laughs> Find the control room. The icicles. <laughs> that, that's hey, listen, if you're ever going to speedrun Halo, it's very imperative that you shoot those icicles. That's the most important part of the run. If you don't do that, run's dead, dude. This is just, this is just literally taking the fastest route possible. Ooh, big, eh, decent boost. Decent boost there, that was pretty good. Oh. Ah, oh, yes, the grab hammer. How I missed you. Woo! Shmovement, shmovement, shmovement. Control rooms at the top of that tower, Chief. Go! This, he's like, you mean this tower? Ha! He's just watching him getting beat up. Oh, there he is. Of course, Reaper. Just as soon as you dispose of all proximate bloodprints. I'm afraid contamination protocols do not allow for... Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Is that the monitor? You didn't tell me he was here. So I guess he... he you 100% have to okay. clean up all the enemies here because because that he's not opening the doors until you clean up everybody. So there's no running past this part. See, this, this is what like this part right here is what a normal video game. This is what if you had to play Halo like a normal video game, this is what it would look like. It would literally have an objective: eliminate all enemies, and you couldn't go any farther until you did so. You know what I mean? But what's so good about Halo is during the other parts of it. It's like your objective is to blow up this thing. You don't have to kill the enemies. You just have to blow up the thing. See, see, see the difference in that? Gonna, oh, he went to go pick up more rockets. He got, he got big rocks. He's got seven rockets now. And that's probably faster than trying to just BR or melee all these enemies down. A little triple kill. Little devil, do ya? Yeah, keep in mind, he, he is playing legendary here. So these guys are actually pretty easy to overwhelm you and kill you. Dude, this part, this part looks like kind of a cluster F right here of, of different... Oh, he missed his rocket there. It looks like it, it, there's not much like formulaic strategy to this. It's more so like you just got to do what's working. Another double kill. Yeah, this is like literally a wave defense right here. I'm waiting for the mega enemies. All right, he's got one rocket left. Oh, he left his he left his grab hammer in the doorway <laughs> for a few hits here. I love setups like that. Like tricks and all are cool, but when you have setups that are like you leave something somewhere and then you use it later, kind of like on the last mission. Do I take life or give it? Who is victim and who is who? It's trying to rebuild itself on this ring. Monka, Monka, Monka. We hate that for you. We hate that for you. All right, here we go. Big fight here, boys. Kill the monitor. Activate Halo. I take no pleasure in doing what must be done. You do not this is, hey, this hey, way. this is a crazy fight so far, dude. I am safe. It belongs to me. <laughs> not for long. Ha! <laughs> it's the Spartan laser. Woo! 
Hey, uh, dude, that, that was close right there. Imagine after all of that, you miss your shot. After all of that, you miss your shot. Is, did his, his hammer replenish ammo? <laughs> He's like, that's a nice spot for the hammer. Look how, look how clean that looks. All right, the way the world ends. <gasps> he grabs it through the wall. That's incredible. Why would he not just leave it in his hand? Oh, it reset. I'm sure it resets your gun. It resets your guns, so he grabbed it through the wall. Oh, he's gonna die. Hunt, no, no shit, no shot he survives this. Never mind, I lied. He's literally a god. Dude, that is so smart. That is legitimately so smart. Because that it doesn't clear the room or whatever. And there's the rocket launcher that he left here earlier. Bruh. Oh no, where's it going now? The frigate. We still have a chance. Ooh, the aim, the aim. Find the doorway in the cliffs, Chief. The dawn is on the other side. The dawn is on the other side. Why this weapon? Out of all the weapons, is this the best one? Is this really the best one? I guess the lack of reload is pretty pretty nice. Hey, that was a two for one. He got some he got some distance boost and he killed that guy right there. Alright. No more hammer boost. He's saving him. Nothing is friendly. Everyone is dying. Everyone is sad. Sad, sad, sad. Ooh, I feel like that was not that was supposed to cover the doorway a little bit better than it did. Don't let this ring be the end of us, Chief. Yeesh! He's through. Not a checkpoint, but a loading zone. I wonder if this game times those loading zones. Ew, 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 ew. There, Johnson's Warthog. Come on, Spartan. Go, go, Ooh. go! There is an invisible man in the gunner seat. Bro, d <laughs> that voice acting is a little rough. Oh, here we go. This is it. Pump the music. The best song. The best song in Halo history. Oh, we're, we're full blasted. I don't care about the ears. at the end of Halo 2 when he did the he did the 360 swag at the very end or was that Halo 1 I can't remember go bro I remember I actually died on this part in legendary I definitely actually died on this part of legendary Go Chief! I mean, this is it, right? This is coming up on time. This is it. For the world, you know he's so happy right now. Because he knows. He knows. He knows. I did not think he was going to make that jump. I'm not going to lie. Go! Oh, 
Oh, he's got it all mapped out. Bro, I, my, my only complaint about this is that they should have the game sounds turned down a little bit or they should just turn the music way up. I want to hear the music, dude. I want to hear the music. Dude, the, fun, the funny part about this is the Warthog Run song is like eight minutes long and this is why it's supposed to take you like eight minutes to do all this. Oh, the big jump. Is he even gonna go off of it? He looks like he's going to the side. Ha! He says F the big jump. That was so close. That was so close. Oh my, dude, look at the explosions, man. There is very minimal speed running straps for this. You just gotta go. You just gotta go. How cool would it be if you used one of these exploding platforms to like launch himself though? It's probably possible, it's just too, it's just too risky. Also, they explode before they get to you. Oh my gosh, he's getting wrecked by these platforms now. Go! Oh! Oh my gosh! That thing exploded. That like landed right in front of him and bounced out of the way perfectly. Yes! Go! Oh, so sick, man. <laughs> Woo! Wow. Wait, does this does this count? Is this time? That's it. That's it right there. That's it. Epilogue, that's time as soon as you dive in there. Oh, he's looking at all of his times. He's looking at all of his times. Dude, that's really cool that they, you base the missions, uh, you base the speed run time off of all of the times added together. That's really cool. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. That is absolutely and totally one of the best speedruns we've ever watched here on the channel. Ladies and gentlemen, if you would like me to react to the rest of the Halo franchise, including like ODST, Reach, all those different things, uh, let me know in the comment section down below, including, you know, four and five. We'll get there. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I had an absolute blast watching this one. Make sure y'all go subscribe to the runner. Rockets, 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 Rocketa. Either way, thank you guys so much for tuning in. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. If y'all have any other ideas that you guys want me to react to in the future, let me know. And we will see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody. Bye-bye.